Hello everyone. How's it going? Well, we have a lot of things to talk about here tonight. Um, what I'm going to be planning on doing with Phantom Elite Paranormal. Um, we're going to talk about uh, our recent filming for the TV series and uh, whatever else comes up. <laughs> um, first off, let's talk about the, the TV series. Um, we're all done filming for that. Um, it was a blast. Uh, we definitely, you know, there's definitely, you know, there's a lot of people that were, you know, saying how the heck did we get on TV, blah, blah, blah. You know, it really, it really is something you have to look into. Um, you really have to study what you're doing because a lot of, you know, a lot of TV Believe it or not, a lot of TV places, you know, you're in for it, for them to make money. You know, that's that's pretty much what that is. Um, and yes, when you give rights away, <laughs> they can do whatever they want. You know, so you got to be careful when you do go out and get on TV because stuff like that can happen. There's a lot of horror stories with with things like that, and you know, it's been a some time that you know even us we you know turned down a lot of stuff to you know go on tv and it really it's fun don't get me wrong but you know there's there's definitely a lot of stuff that you have to keep in mind when you're going on tv <laughs> that's for sure um like i said the, these videos the show probably will release next year i'm not really sure as soon as the producers tell us exactly when that is. Um, but uh, as for future TV programming, oh yeah, um, we definitely have some stuff in the works for actual um, in the field type work, getting in, you know, um, really getting into the tech side and which we're probably going to do with our YouTube channel as well um, something I haven't seen done yet and um, I'm planning on making our shows like episodes like on TV and then releasing them later on so moving forward with that is um, I'm thinking about I'm going to re-edit past shows that are on our YouTube channel already and make them into more of a like a TV format like ep by episode and season um, otherwise you know I was planning on doing a few live stuff this year but that that's about it I'm, I'm thinking about releasing our new shows in the fall and then they'll play out um, throughout the fall and winter seasons so you guys are not just sitting here wondering what the heck's going on. Um, I plan on having at least five to ten videos, shows, um, through the summer, which would be easy to do. Um, we're gonna, I'm gonna try some new projects of mine, which will get you guys more involved with our shows and. You know, because I'm moving more into the direction of being interactive, um, more interactive with our viewers. And, you know, what are our goals as a paranormal team? You know, are we, you know, are we going to be um, purely, you know, because I, because, you know, we, I just had somebody review all of our shows, and I mean, we got a, a pretty good viewer base I think but yeah I mean yes it could be better um I I won't even doubt after the show on TV releases that we'll be super swamped um I have no doubt in my mind that we're gonna see a jump in subscribers and that uh so you know you really I mean I've been really thinking like you know I've been doing this a long time you know I've been changing this up, you know, the past couple of years, and, you know, it's how I 
that's how I edit these. And I mean, I really would like to have some, you know, I'd give them somebody, give somebody else our videos, have them edit it for me, and then change it into a TV format. Um, I'm, I mean, I'm, I'm good at editing, but I'd rather have a third party view of, you know, because when I get involved with editing, I want everything, you know, I want everything in the video. And it's hard to think third party when it comes down to it because I think I'll all you know I would I would upload complete raw footage if I had to and it's keeping an even balance you know of our viewers I mean there's people that want to come to our site for you know just to be terrified you know or technical review or I mean I have a wide variety actually on this page you know and you know, having somebody look over our videos and saying that I, you know, I, the re-edit, changed the names to episodes and, and cutting them down to a viewer format of, like, being on TV. Um, because it really, it really took some time to, to get where we're at right now, you know, and I like the real aspect of, you know, what we do. But having that balance of everything in one, it, it's it can be difficult. And you know, I had somebody recently to tell me that you know if what is your your main focus, and I'm like it's everything paranormal. <laughs> but you know, I'm like I don't expect people to go through all of our videos and pick out which ones extremely. I mean, we do have people that do that, obviously. You know, we have the extreme scary stuff going on, and then we have, there's nothing going on, guys. You know, we're just going to put a show out. Um, and we're, we're going to continue doing that. It's just um, keeping, keeping our goals compact. That's, that's really what it is. And... Uh, I want to use the Connect 2 this year, but they're my new my new idea. I'm just not sure how I'm going to edit this um, because I want to I want to add 360 videos uh, to our shows. Actually, maybe even film a whole show in 360. That's that's really what I want to do, and obviously I'm not. I don't know how to edit those yet so it's gonna be a lot of trial and error so a lot a lot to do with you know re-editing old shows so I can get the hang of 360 videos um, but then again I'm not really sure how that would work out with normal video and 360 together I just don't know if that will work or not I'd have to have a probably have a whole show just in 360 it's a lot of work. Um, my computer can handle it, I do believe, um, but that's not that's not my problem. It's just getting a new a new look on what we're doing. You know, um, that is, we are working with producers for an actual TV show that's in 360 all you know with camera crews and that but uh, I don't know I don't know if that goes that goes but what I'm, I'm going to try to do it on YouTube because I like um, the VR aspect of things and you know if we could do a show completely you know I don't know much of our viewers probably have standard televisions and that but I really want to get into the aspect of having you guys with us and go through our videos and find stuff that I have missed you know or I want that interaction you know that's that's what we're gonna probably focus on this year um, I mean uh, we've been doing it for a couple years now with these blogs or whatever it's just um, a lot to think about you know, it's staying ahead of the times, 
you know, I think VR is going to be number one for, you know, for, it's, it's getting there. Uh, I'm getting my own VR headset gear um, for the PlayStation 4, so, so I should be able to watch VR shows. That is, I think that is the future of everything. So, um, so what else am I trying to think of? Um, I mean, I do want to go back to the TV thing, you know, uh, getting on TV. You know, if you really, if a lot of people out there are like, how can I get on TV? It's, you know, it's nothing to really do with how good you are. I mean, obviously, experience does, you know, help. But I think um, knowing... That was weird. I think knowing um, what TV studios and stuff know um, what they they try to do for, uh, to you you know if you're not paying attention um, like I said before they, they you know it's you're definitely there for views and it's what they want unless unless you get it you have to get shit <laughs> you gotta get shit in writing you know that's that's a number one key um, if if you ever get offered to be on TV for anything it doesn't mean and paranormal shows and that and, you know it's just um, just getting on there and talking about your stuff and knowing what networks to w actually work with and you know who to write because you, you pretty much have to write a lot of stuff to a lot of producers um, if you want to pitch show ideas and but um, the the one that we were working with was really really nice to us we got a lot of stuff done with them and sorry I'm kind of like monotone I just uh, haven't really haven't really f felt the need to make a video lately I, I just um, had a lot of stuff fly my way just recently and stuff that I actually really have to think about and you know are we going to keep this team the way it is, change it, or, or quit completely, start something new? I mean, I mean, this channel originally was, you know, just strictly almost raw footage because I didn't know how to edit or anything like that. And, you know, I'm, I'm trying to throw, like, spiritual stuff, everything in one, like, everything paranormal. And it can get side yeah I think you get sidetracked pretty well um, as to having new members maybe um, as well uh, I really want to get somebody that can go out in the field when, when I don't have to be on every single show or at least have somebody talking more than, than me <laughs> <laughs> um, it really is getting that perfect sync of people to communicate with you on camera. I mean, Jesse's awesome. You know, Jesse plays off of me a lot, <laughs> and vice versa. And uh, you know that Nicole and Jesse kind of keep me on track because I, I kind of like <laughs> go off on a tangent uh, at certain places, and I'm excited. Um, that you know this year I actually have time to do more filming so it might actually even be more than 10 <laughs> um, but I don't know what do you guys think it should be more of a TV format or keep it what we're doing um, you know there is I love you know I love I love our interaction that we have now but having more would be ideal um, you know we just reach a thousand subscribers which <laughs> it, it's, it's, it's cool um, you know we have a f I'd rather have people watch us on a regular basis 
like religiously than somebody coming to our page and like wow that's scary as heck you know you know you know it's not really necessarily about freaking people out it's it it, it happens <laughs> but not all the time um, we definitely like to show those shows that are are just off the wall bonkers you know and some of the really are the ones that really get people's attention though that's to be honest with you but I, I mean I like I said before I don't expect people to go like straight through all of our videos I mean we have had people been binge watch us before but you know it's <laughs> it's awesome you know and I mean there's a lot we know I take a lot of constructive criticism as well um you know, I do take it the, I do take it into focus that, that, to tweak our videos a little bit more. I mean, we're we're not consistent, obviously, in a lot of our videos. Um, we do different formats every freaking time we do a video because I feel the need that that particular video needs to be done a different way. But to have like a beginning, a middle, and an end is kind of, it's, it's kind of. I guess it's kind of difficult to keep that format because some days I, you know, I want to get all like super technical, and some days I want to be all spiritual with with our videos, and it, you, you simply can't really mix the two unless, like I said, unless I have somebody uh, be like a third party editor, you know, I, I'd, you know, you won't get paid to do it or anything, but it for fun you know but I don't know new members you know has been something I've been thinking about too so I don't know um, I've been looking at a lot of our subscribers videos lately actually um, I've been looking at the spirit chick lately she has a lot of cool stuff on there I, and um, you could find her on our top recommended channels on our main page if you want to check out her stuff. She's a, she's a, she's kind of like me. She kind of has the the spiritual side and then the technical side. And I like how she how the videos are done. Um, I don't I don't like really watching too many paranormal shows, <laughs> but. Um, the ones that I do like, I do kind of do shout outs of once in a while. Um, um, Dogman Encounters, man, that, that, that place, that channel, fucking wicked. Those, those stories, just don't watch them at night. <laughs> they, they, they suck. Alright, well, I gotta go here.